Dude, you better not blow that up. Dude. Oh my god. Bro, don't worry about it. I'm obviously gonna fill it in. Like, who do you think I am? When when I get back from mining, that better be filled. Yeah, of course it's gonna be filled. Okay, I'm trusting you. Boom. That right there was the biggest mistake I've ever made in my life. That one decision of trusting my friend Siwat to fill in the creeper hole before I got back would lead to a whole series of catastrophic events. Are you serious? And you still haven't filled this hole? What, what do you mean? It's Look at the middle. What? That is not filled. Well, it only dropped like eight dirt when it exploded. That's all I had. Oh my god. You had one... What is this? What did you do? Well, I was trying to collect dirt to finish this hole and there were so many creepers. There's just no way these are getting filled. And that's exactly right. The holes never got filled. The combined laziness of us not wanting to fill in the creeper holes ourselves would lead to events that would be irreversible. And before we knew it, it was too late. This is what life was like now that creeper holes were never filled. Luckily, I managed to shield my house off from all the creepers, but that was the only thing left. Other than that, all of the world had been demolished to the void. This whole world was gone. All I had left was my piece of floating land in the sky, but when I looked out, there was nothing left. All that I could see was just the endless drop into the void. Since there was nowhere left to go, I was only relying on the farm I had in my house. But soon after, the water dried up, and this was my last yield of crops. Soon, it would be the end for me. I lost hope for animals spawning a long time ago since all the land had been destroyed by creepers. As for the people, well, I used some of the dirt from my island to branch out as far as I could to see if I could find any survivors, but there wasn't enough dirt to go around so I had to make a bunch of holes in the paths just so I could branch out even further. To my surprise, I actually found a few survivors left in this world, but not all of them were nice. This apocalypse made people turn into monsters. Whoa, 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 okay, okay. I know we both found this pig, but we can settle this peacefully. You don't understand. I'm gonna starve without this pig. I haven't had food in months. Look, I know it's been tough for everyone, but I'm sure there's a way we can share. We don't have to come to violence. This pig is mine. Don't make me do this. I didn't want to take the shot, but I had to. We both took a shot at each other, but luckily enough, I managed to stay on the platform. Even though I managed to survive that encounter, it wasn't going to be long before I suffered the same fate as he did. When it became clear that I was about to run out of food, I decided to pay one last visit to my friend. Ah, oh, please don't fall, please don't fall. I don't want to go out this way. I'm going to starve soon anyways, so I'd rather not go out by falling. Hey man, how you doing? Holding up, man. Just, I miss the good old days where we could walk and not have to worry about falling. Yeah, I miss those days too. Well, look, we only have five pieces of bread left, so look, I'll split it with you. We can go on over to my island, and we can enjoy the rest of our lives. That'd be wonderful, man. All right, after you. Ah! Ah! Oh! No! The walk back to the house was depressing. As if life couldn't get any worse, I just had to watch my only friend plunge to his death. And I was even more upset because I knew there was only one person left to visit before this world would end. And it's the last person I ever wanted to see. Ah, uh, well, I guess there's no other choice but to go visit the idiot that caused this whole mess. Okay, whatever. I started making my journey across the dirt path that I haven't crossed in years. And I came upon him. <gasps> so after all these years, you're finally going to visit me? Well, why would I ever want to see your face after you didn't fill that creeper hole and cause this whole mess? I told you, bro, I was working on it. If you just gave me a little more time, I would have filled them. Well, obviously that didn't work out, okay? It's just... Whoa, whoa, whoa. What is, what is that down there? What do you see? I need to go back. I immediately rushed back to the house and I went to the basement because I knew there was one chance that we had. I had been storing something in secret for 20 years because I knew that we just might need it. It was the last water bucket. If I could use this water bucket and pull this off, I could save the world. I went back up to the top floor and grabbed an empty bucket and I raced back to the prison cell. I was scared since this was our only chance to save the world, but I placed down the water bucket and I jumped on down to go grab this bucket of lava. I got on down and secured the bucket and started climbing my way back up to hopefully change the fate of the universe. 
I have something to show you. Do you know what this is? Is that a lava bucket? It is. I found it just below there. You know what this means? Yeah, this changes everything. We could make a cobblestone generator and eventually find lands that haven't been destroyed. We're saved. I think it's time I let you out and we can solve the fate of humanity together. What do you say? Let's do this. God, it's been so many years since I've made a cobblestone generator, but I think I remember how to do it. Whoa, okay. whoa. I'm pretty sure that's wrong. We need a dirt there. You sure? Yeah, if we don't do that, it's going to make obsidian. Okay, because if we're wrong, the fate of the world rests in our hands. Yeah, I'm positive. Okay. Let's save the world. Are you ready? I'm ready, man. Let's do this. Oh my god, I told you we had to do it the other way. What are you talking about? You just told me to do it this way. No, we were supposed to not have a block there. It was so obvious. That's it. You're going back to the cell. 